Hallelujah. You will see the wonders in praise this week. It will be an experience of a lifetime. It will turn the tables around in your favor. Doors will open to you on their own accord. The days of your struggles are finally over. The days of your struggles are finally over. When we pray, according to his will, he hears us. Or when we praise him, he comes down. And when God comes down, the impossible happens. God will come down in your case this week. The impossible things will happen in your life. In the name of Jesus. As you have been anointed today, expect God to turn your money into dancing. Your sorrows to joy and rejoicing. Your complaints to celebrations. In the name of Jesus Christ. Expect today to receive the oil of joy. The oil of gladness. The garment of praise. They are all products of the anointing. You will go from here with a new name. You will not be found among the victims of life again. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Take your bottles of oil. Please be reminded for all our new members and new converts. The third Sunday of every month is our special monthly anointing service. And when you are anointed with fresh oil, it silences your enemies. So in the name of Jesus, the anointing of today you will remember for a lifetime. It will destroy the siege of depression. Yeah. Depression, what the Bible calls the spirit of heaviness. Today, the spirit of heaviness will be off your life forever. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Yeah. Concerning Christ, says, anointed him with the oil of gladness above his fellows. So the anointing summarizes the oil of gladness. As I mean, Psalm 45, 6, and 7. By this anointing today, gladness will become your new identity. No more caring about long faces. Your continents shall remain ever cheerful. From today, you'll be smarter than your enemies. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. It is not unspiritual to be challenged, but it's unscriptural to be defeated. It's not unspiritual to be challenged, but it's anti-covenant to be defeated. Today marks the end of defeat in your life. As you praise him, you gain access to the secret concerning your issue. And you'll be set free from it forever. Marital siege is over in your life. Marital storms is calm in your life. The siege of marital delay is destroyed in your life. And I decree today that no door of favor shall be shut against you anymore. Every well that the enemy has taught, I command them to reopen. Every closed door against your destiny is reopened today. In the name of Jesus. It's one thing to know what to do, it's another thing to do it. It is in doing it that we see the miracle power of God. Whatever it tells you to do, what did he say? Do it. He didn't say quote it, he said do it. In the court, he said, do it. So make the remaining part of this week, beginning from tonight, 
one hour minimum of celebrating the faithfulness of God in your life. You sit and begin to count them. You count them and begin to praise him. You praise them and begin to dance. And I can tell you this, you will see what you have never thought possible before in your life. The balance shall become joyful mother of children. Separated homes shall be supernaturally reunited. Cases of near divorce shall be broken. Every child that may have gone astray, they will return. I celebrate God, he turns to a celebrity. So it's your turn. It's your turn. As a new generation Abraham, grace to keep giving glory to God at all times, under all circumstances, receive it now. Grace to keep obeying God, no matter how anybody else may feel, receive it right now. It's your turn. Open your bottles, please. And leave them up before the Lord. The content of the, these bottles is hereby declared the holy anointing oil. Yeah. And because yokes are destroyed by the anointing, every barrier on your path is declared destroyed. Yeah. Every closed door is declared open. Yeah. Every open door opens wider. Yeah. Same time, every plague of sickness and disease is declared destroyed from the root. Yeah. By this anointing, you will not know the meaning of depression anymore in your life. Yeah. The days of your money are declared over. Yeah. The days of shedding tears behind closed doors is declared over. Yeah. Your spiritual life takes a new turn today. Yeah. In the precious name of Jesus. Yeah. And so shall it be. Yeah. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Now it's by the Holy Spirit we gain access to divine secrets. He shows us things to come. He receives from the Father. He reveals it to us. Our God is custodian of all secrets. And the Holy Ghost is his, his channel for communicating his secrets with us. By this anointing, I decree your open access to divine secrets. Because it is divine secrets that make stars in the kingdom. I command your stars to rise. 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 The siege, the siege of stagnation is destroyed. You will not be found on the same spot anymore. You are going forward from this day onward. In the name of Jesus Christ. May everyone's praise be accepted to God this week. May it come down with living testimonies. You are returning this coming Sunday with your living testimony. Yeah. Many of us, the only make with service will give your testimonies. Yeah. Many will give their testimonies at the coming hour of prayer. Yeah. Because something unusual will happen in your life. Yeah. Many miracle jobs shall be delivered this week. Yeah. Many dying business will bounce back to life this week. If you believe your own is there, let me hear your loudest amen. Yeah. One more time, the coin of your bottle is declared the holy anointing oil. Yeah. Put your finger tip on it and place it on your forehead and begin to make your declarations. You shall have whatsoever you say. You shall have whatsoever you say. The days of defeat are over. The days of mourning are over. The days of complaining and mourning, they are over. The days of defeat are over. The days of depression are over. Begin to make your declaration, both declarations. 
Your health and wholeness is restored. The days of weakness are over. Welcome to your days of strength. Welcome to your days of strength. You not only have testimonies this week, you become a testimony this week. The world will see the hand of God evidently on your, on your life. New dawn, new dawn, new dawn, new dawn, new dawn. Every closed door is open. Every open door opens wider. In the name of Jesus. The siege of sickness and disease is over. The siege of depression is over. Joy and rejoice becomes your new portion, your new identity. Gladness of heart becomes your new identity. Your countenance will remain ever cheerful. And that will be coming from your spirit man. And thank you, Father. In Jesus' precious name, we have made that declaration. Whatever you have declared from your mouth with faith, the hand of God will make it happen. This shall be a week of testimonies for you. It shall be a week of celebrations for you. In the precious name of Jesus. So shall it be in Jesus' name. When you get home today, anoint your house. It shall become a heart of joy and gladness. Anoint your bedroom. There shall be no depression anymore in your life. Every show of concern in your life will be turned to a testimony. In the name of Jesus Christ. And place yourself on the treatment of the oil, the anointing oil this week. Whatever represents this the mystery behind any disease in your life, any poison you might have taken, anything forced into you while you sleep, Jesus will rout them out. In the name of Jesus. Cover your bottles, everyone, and give thanks to God. Give thanks to God. Give thanks to your God. Give him praise. In Jesus' precious name. Now we're going to have the first stage of the dance. The dance on a personal note begins tonight. We take the fire of praise from the altar and it will drive us throughout the week. Ensure to give your God a one hour of solid celebration, appreciation, thanksgiving, and praise all through the week. In the name of Jesus, you will emerge supernaturally victorious. Yeah. Over any issue you give thanks, it will be turned to a testimony. Yeah. Now let's praise him to 